Hi, Susan Blue Robot here from SusanBlueRobot.com. Um, I'm back today with a, another video, help video as promised. Um, this is how to fold the arches, especially those very tiny ones, are a lot easier. Um, I came up with this when I was folding Andy's White House for him. Uh, the White House card which is on my blog um, and I thought I'd share it with you this is make the cuts pop-up card studio so um, instead of doing a real tiny one I've overscaled this uh, um, tier so I can give you an idea of how I come about folding it a lot easier so what we'll do I've made this this um, videos on how to make this sort of thing on my blog um, so we'll get to it so first off with this this top this is the, the um, thing that I want to take across to make the cut as well so I'll click on that do a copy then I'll turn this um, uh, card I could export render render it SVG Oh no, that's what I wanted help for help. And now what I do, that's all correct. Now what I do is I go to make the cut and I bring it into make the cut. This one. And I'll also paste in place that um one that I got from here because this is the one the main one that we need now what we will do is we'll go back to make the cut now um, what we what we want to have is this piece plus a piece for down at the bottom but if you notice that down the bottom we'll zoom in Down the bottom is the same shape as up the top here. You notice that? So, what we need is to bring in a square. give myself a little bit of a handle to play with so so we with those two select uh, nope. with those two selected we'll do a line to the top and then we will do a bullion join now this is how to get the templates for the folding why is that not letting me do a boy and Now it will, so put those two selected. Um, I think it's the inclusion we want. Mm. I think this AB we want apply. Then we go paste in place the first one. So we've got now got two shapes. This shape for up here and this shape for down here. Now the one thing I did do in this trial and error to work out a quick and easier way to fold the um arch steps and things is I then selected them and gave them an inward shadow in millimeters I haven't converted it into um, that's too much 
I think no I think it was point seventy five. Hang on, let me just I just needed a slight, if you look here, I just need a slightly bit in because I'll go accept that. And here's the shadow less. We'll turn this one off and turn this one off for the moment. So now what we have, if I break this apart, is this one fits in there and this one fits in there. So now what I do is I throw away the originals. Cut that one. Cut that one. So you would cut your card out as normal and you'd cut this in a slightly heavier card stock. So you'd end up with your car, with your slits in it, with your mountain and valley folds and in your normal card stock and this in a bit of scrap heavier card stock. Now um, the, that you've got that, <coughs> you go over to susanbluerobot.com and you go to video help 004. Um, B. This is 004A video. If you go to 004B video, it will show how I exactly fold these up easily using this template that I've generated. This has been Susan Blue Robot from SusanBlueRobot.com. Um, this is another quick help video from make the cuts pop-up card studio and if you'd like to purchase pop-up card studio there's a link below this video or there's many links on my blog at susanblueroboc.com